back to La Ronde, day number two. Can't come all the way to Montreal and not go to La Ronde for two days in a row. So I will tell you guys this, if you do plan on coming here, put P8 in your GPS, cause that's where their parking lot is. Otherwise you'll like never find it. This whole complex is like crazy. And then it's kind of like around, like almost behind the park in a way too, so. Well, with that said, let's go head in and have more of an awesome day here at Laron because this park is very underappreciated. So let's go inside and have a good time. Just like that, I managed to make my way into the park. Gonna go uh, ride some monster or ride some Goliath. This thing looks like a monster in its own. It's so pretty, it's so cool in its own way. I wonder if this is left over from the World's Fair that was here. Quite possibly, yes, but all about that monster I see hiding in the trees over there. So let's go ride. I'm not gonna lie, I really do kind of love this ride. It's such a good, awesome, fun wooden coaster. Crazy in its own way, so let's go ride. All right, that was super good as always. I love that ride. It's so fun in so many ways. It's just like, I don't know. It's not like any wooden coaster like I was telling you guys before. Seriously, just get here and ride it. You'll see what I mean. How like, it's got these crazy like almost, I want to say like almost an inversion because it's tilts so far to the left or to the right. Like you have so much like, you're so on your side. It's pretty cool. But I'm going to go uh, get the awesomeness that is Goliath. So I'll hit you back when I get there. So who would have thought one of the best hypers <laughs> lies in Montreal, Canada? I mean, come on guys, it's so good. If you've ridden it, then you know what I'm talking about. If you haven't ridden it yet, I'm gonna tell you what I, what I said before. Get the Laurent and go ride Goliath. It's where it's at. It's one of the best ones out there. So smooth, so much airtime, so much ejector airtime, and just radical in its own Laurent type of way. Well, I'm gonna cruise around and uh, it's almost lunchtime, so I think I'm gonna grab some food because that just sounds awesome right now. So let's go find something scrumptious because this park's full of good stuff. So I found my way over here and I'm gonna get some awesome kebabi goodness because that just sounds really good. Look at all the scrumptiousness they have in here already. And you can get it on the dining pass too, so it's even better. I got the bottom one and they said it was like, like a sausage type of one, so uh, it should be pretty good. You can also get uh, burgers and like protein and stuff too but super good and we'll find out how scrumptious it actually is. All this good stuff. So I'm totally not exactly sure what this is, but it smells really good. It looks really good. It seems like it's like some type of Indian food, but I don't know. We'll dig in and it just looks awesome. And so I went with it. So that might be the best thing I've ever had at Six Flags on Dining Pass. I'm not gonna lie. Like so, like the um, the sausage ones. It tasted like almost like halal meat, kind of like in like a gyro or like something to that nature. It was super good. The white sauce was like almost like a garlic sour cream sauce, and it tasted really good when you mixed it with the rice and like the sausage. And then the salad on the side of it, super good. It had almost like a ranch style dressing on it, but it wasn't ranch. It was super good. And then they had um, a pile of potatoes in there as well. You mix it all together and put it together. It was super good in so many ways. Like literally, this is probably one of the best things I've ever had at Six Flags. And especially on Dining Pass, you can't go wrong. Well, I'm gonna keep on cruising around a little bit and go have some more fun because that's what you do in the run. You go ride and have fun. So past the dragon, down into the woods we go to find the Ferris wheel. <laughs> Let's go ride because I've been wanting to ride this since yesterday, so. Let's go ride this awesome wheel. 
Oh yeah, Ferris wheel time. Let's go ride the wheel of Laurent. Such a cool view from up here. You really can't go wrong. This pretty park. Well, that was super awesome. Shout out to the awesome individuals that I met on the Ferris wheel. You guys are super cool. And yeah, that was a beautiful view of this amazing park in this amazing city. So I'm gonna keep on cruising. And since I am right next to the dragon's lair, let's go ride the dragon because <laughs> why not? That's just like a weird dark ride coaster, but it's cool in its own way. I mean, it's kind of dark in there. It's got some cool lighting effects, the dragon. I mean, you can't go wrong with that. So no, I found my way over to the Batman clone, one of the other good rides in this park. So uh, let's go hang out with the vampire. That has the symbol of, uh, what is that, a vampire? Or is that Batman? Let's get a little bit closer. Okay, it is a vampire. No, wait, no, it's a Batman. Oh, wait. It's a Batman clone, so uh, let's go uh, ride the vampire then, right? Because it says vampire, but it looks like a bat clone. And you get the idea, let's just go ride. <laughs> it was a Batman clone. Oh wait, a vampire. It was still good though, either way. I don't know. It was uh, just good times. I'm just chill today if you guys haven't like figured that out by now. <laughs> I'm gonna go ride some more Goliath because that's just a super rad ride and it's my favorite one in the park. So uh, let's go hit it up again. So when I tell you guys, it's that good, it's that good. Oh, it's so much fun in so many ways. Well, like all good things must come to an end. My day at Laurent is gonna come to an end. I got other stuff I gotta go do. I've been here for two days. It's kind of a long time to come to this park because it's not like really big. And there's only like two or three really good rides. So, I mean, it is what it is. But if you get the chance to make it here, literally do it. It's worth it alone just for Goliath. So good. All right, guys. Well, love you all. Stay safe, beautiful, and amazing, and comment and share, and peace. So after I left the park, I thought it was worth a shot to ask security if I can come back here and film this, and they said yes. Now I realize just how much land this park has on this island out here. Look at all that. It's all parking, but they still have a ton of land out there. This is crazy. wonder if they ever actually get that busy here. If anyone, this is your home park and you know if Laurent actually gets this busy where they even use this, comment below. But this coaster is amazing. I'll put a cool clip for you. Please be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Love you all.